So this is quite new. This is a uh, this is a typical 50 watt LED with the 50 big chips in it and the five rows of 10. And this is something completely new to me. It's a it's a 25 watt LED and it's almost like a cheap copy, but it's instead of actually just passing it off as a 50 watt LED and it comes out with the 20 watt driver, they're actually saying it's a 25 watt LED. And inside, the, the most obvious difference looking at it initially is that the chips inside are not only running in an opposite direction to the... These ones run uh, sort of in, at right angles to the main uh, connection terminals. These ones run in line with them. And the reason for that is that the strange arrangement of the metal in here that uh, is actually connect to this end, then it goes round and sticks out the side. In this case, they've actually just extended that straight out the end. And the chips inside are minute. They're the sort of chips you'd find in an ordinary 5mm LED. You know, something like just this, if that. It, it just looks like the tiniest little chips. And when you pick it up, it's like really obviously different. This one feels heavy. This one feels very, very light. And if you look at the side of them, this one's got a thick aluminium plate to help spread the heat and get it uh, dissipated out. This one is much thinner. And of course, it's missing the extra metal inside. Um, so it's interesting. Now, I have done my uh, test that lots of people don't like. They think it doesn't really represent a proper test on the LEDs in these. But uh, if you get a good LED and you stick a low voltage across them, then they should all, all light evenly as soon as you reach the combined forward voltage of the LEDs. But this one is one of these ones that's just, you know, just right, lighting up randomly um, because there's so much uh, parasitic resistance across the chips suggesting they're not really the greatest of uh, LEDs. So this is very much a poor man's, uh, poor man's LED. I, I wonder how many lights are being put out with these in them. Um, but at least they are, they're not trying to pretend it's a 50 watt LED and it certainly isn't. It's got the 50 chips, but they're just rating them half watt each. Uh, whether, you know, I would even rate them half watt is debatable. But yeah, I just thought it would be quite interesting taking a look at these and see what was uh, different about them.